The economy is steadily on the rise, and so is the rate of people quitting their jobs. <laughs> that coincides with a steady increase in small business startups, and this is kind of an interesting dynamic we're seeing. That's right. People are quitting their jobs so they can start up their own small right. business, and we have somebody here who says this is the perfect time to start your own business. Nellie Akalps joins us now from CorpNet, and why is this a great time to start up your own small business? Well, let me first say this. I am so ecstatic about where our economy is headed. You know, we are set on track for the best growth since 2005, which means that the economy is ripe for anyone creating a successful startup business. And do you think that maybe during the recession when people were being laid off, they felt like they had to get creative and maybe come up with an idea to start up their own company, and now they feel like they can pull the trigger, so to speak, and go for it? Absolutely. You know, we, in fact, started our business at the height of the recession in 2009. And let me say this. Consumer spending is at an all-time high right now. It's skyrocketing. And anybody wanting to start a business, it's the best time right now because the likelihood of people buying your products and services is there and it exists. You sound almost like a shill for the Obama administration <laughs> talking about growth in our economy. Now, we, we know that Republicans are less enthusiastic about this recovery that we have seen, but you seem to think that the economy is very robust. Absolutely. You know, it, what's really interesting to me is that, you know, year after year at our company, we see a 40% growth in the number of people starting businesses. And this January, it's really, really, the growth is substantial. We've seen 100% growth over last January in the number of people starting small businesses. And again, it's confirmation and validation that our economy is headed in the right direction and uh, consumers are spending and they're comfortable with the idea of spending. All right, Nellie, let's talk turkey. You had me at hello. All right, you got me. So how do I get a loan now? Because the um, complaint in the past post-recession, or we're in the middle of it, the banks weren't lending money to people. So how do you start up a company? Are the banks softening up and lending money? Well, you know, you can definitely align yourself with resources out there, such as the SBA score. But really, to start a business, a lot of people think it's so overwhelming, and it's really not. You can start a business as little as $49 and at a fraction of a cost of what an attorney or a professional would cost you. And we've broken it down in four simple steps for you. All okay. right, and we'll put all that information yeah. on our website. Well, I just want to make sure people want yeah. to, you're, you're here to say that you can help people start small business, right? At CorpNet, how yeah. do they get in touch with you at CorpNet? You can get in touch with us by visiting us online okay. at www.corpnet.com or simply email us to info at corpnet.com and we will make sure that your business is set up legally and professionally. And you know what will make it easy on everyone watching right now and put it on our website. We'll link everything up at mynews3.com. One thing to remember. Nellie, thank you so much for coming in. Thank you for having me.